What is up YouTube? Hello Party Pirates! Today we have another Marvel Snap decklist coming at you. This one featuring newest card Celine. Now, sorry about a little bit of the difference in background and stuff. I'm actually uh, visiting my girlfriend's family for Christmas, so but I just really wanted to get this video out because this card is just so much fun. Celine is a card that is now in series five. It's the newest card and is has the on-reveal ability of inflicting the lowest power card in each player's hand with minus three power. And I love, love, love symmetrical effects like this that you can kind of build your deck around to take make it way less of a downside, or in this case, even an upside. We are playing both goblins here with Celine. So if Celine comes down, she will, if either of these goblins in her hand, make them just even more powerful. Instead of being a 5, negative 8, Hobgoblin here can be a 5, negative 11. Uh, and then, because we were playing the goblins and Hood with a little bit of a Viper combination, I immediately went to, if you haven't gotten it by now with all the videos I've been putting out, Ravona. Ravona is going to make these goblins cost even cheaper. And, because we have all of these cheap goblins, what better way to you what better card to put in this deck than freshly nerfed werewolf by night this way instead of him while the three mana werewolf by night into four mana sentry into five mana nihilus was seeing a lot of play now that he's four mana that curve doesn't work out as well but in this ravona list if you don't have the sentry nihilus werewolf combo you don't necessarily need it as much because you can go werewolf into green goblin into Hood, Annihilus, all of these are on reveals, all of these are triggering Werewolf by Nights. If you have the Selene, one of those cards is going to be even more power. It's really fun. So, for now, sit back, relax, and enjoy another Marvel Snap deck highlight clip. Uh, let's first things first, pick up this the Selene, so we can start living that Selene dream. Selene. Selene. All right. Get it for tokens. Man, we are going for that alternate art. I think Celine is going to be a ton of fun. And just a card I'm going to want that alternate art for. Would not recommend. Nobody should go for this. is a terrible use of tokens to do this, but. Uh, Alright, here we go. It is a terrible use of tokens, but. We are going for this alternate art Celine and Black Knight. And honestly, I'm probably hoping to get this Iron Lad too. So maybe we'll get the Iron Lad first. If we get the Celine and the Black Knight, I might stop. But all right, first one. Here we go. Ooh, man, that looks good. All right, well, we got it first. We can stop, but no, I want this Black Knight too. So... Hopefully we can get it in three. Ah, Legion. All right. We were expecting to get a duplicate, kind of, so. Let's go open up another one here. Let's see what we got. Black Knight. You know what? Let's just get this Iron Lad. It's not a great... It's This is a terrible use of caches, but... Oh, it looks so good. All right. Now, uh... Let's get into some playing. Ooh, nice. So we'll have the Werewolf, Sentry, and Nihilus combo. So hopefully we can just get some... Oh, nice. And we got some Mana Cheat here. With the Super Flow. Super Flow. Definitely looking to draw like a Goblin. Vona. So we got four mana now. Ooh, so we can win that. So we just do this. And then we play Hobgoblin middle. Don't be a Lyoth. Miss Marvel. Nice. So that won't even win them right. Uh, Even with what we've got. So we can hit them with this. And then we can hit them with Sentry. This is going perfect. Jeff. Okay, so Jeff technically means they'll go to 5, 8, minus 10, 2. 
minus two. So they'll still be losing middle. So we're not too worried about that one. So I think we play Jeff and Snap. And then we'll have seven mana so we can like Annihilus. We can Havoc middle and then Annihilus. Because we got a win left now. So let's Snap. We also have Shadow King if anything crazy like a Gamora comes down or something. Yeah, Miss Marvel is what we were expecting. So they go up to 11 with uh, winning Baxter building, but they won't be winning Baxter building long. So now we can Annihilus Havoc. Yeah. And then even if they play Shang-Chi here, we'll have 8... 15, and then we'll hit them over with the Widow's Bite, which will tie it. Okay, it doesn't tie it. So we have to, so they play the Shang-Chi, which takes off the five power. So what do they got here? Not enough. Nice, and we cast roll them. Sweet. Ooh, okay. Well, we're not going to hood the warrior fault. We will Selene. Though. Because. Yeah. We're going to Selene this warrior fault because we don't really care if Selene dies. We'd rather hold on to these like negative six power hoods and stuff. Oh, that's really bad. I'm going to hold off a turn. It could be a dark hawk list. Yeah, they're definitely a Dark Hawk list. We did smash that Zabu, though, which is very nice. So let's do this, and then we'll play Werewolf. And then we can play this and this. Kill these left, and then we'll drop the Annihilus. Right. We're gonna fill them up really well here. So this looks really good. We're filling the middle. And honestly, this demon will probably win us mid unless they commit to it right now. Okay. So they have Jeff. So... We have to do this because we drew <laughs> three rocks, but we might be okay. We'll see how much power they can put mid if they can put six. Okay, so Darkhawk wins them there, but then that's not enough. Nice. Even with the Darkhawk and Subterranea, we still won that. Ooh. Nice, we got Selene. And uh, the Hobgoblin. Hopefully we can get Ravona. Ooh, Werewolf would be really good with all of these uh, on reveals that we've got here. Agent 13, cool. Oh. They're playing a Loki deck. It's a little problematic. That is most likely problematic. Gotta keep playing stuff <laughs> so we don't get our hand filled like them. They're missing draws. So Loki likes Triskelion, but unless they already have the Loki, so far they're not drawing anything. This is like Barrage or something. They're also not drawing anything and they'll get a Havoc. Wolverine. What? Are both of these in their deck? They are. Uh, 
Let's do this and then we can Valkyrie it if something goes crazy. Yeah, nice. Nice, okay, so we filled them right. So now we can just play Sentry here, Valkyrie here, and then like Hobgoblin left. Or if we draw um, a Nihilist, a Nihilist would be great because it uh, can win us right by destroying our ninja. Ooh, we also have 10 power. Let's play Hobgoblin here and figure out what we draw. Because Valkyrie can win us right with Typhoid Mary coming down. We're tied middle. Wolfsbane also wins us right. So we could like Wolfsbane and play Havoc somewhere. What do they got? I wonder if this was made from Triskelion or 13. Triskelion. It is kind of a shame we didn't draw our Nihilus that turn, but we're less likely to draw it since we missed a draw from Triskelion. They missed two draws. Ooh, okay. Oh, please give me a... Uh, Annihilus. <laughs> Watu from Agent 13. Annihilus? Oh, man. Okay, so we play Wolfsbane, Viper. Viper is the same thing as Havoc, it only has the ability to throw the Sleen over there. This is 1, 3, 5, 7. Not going to snap them because I think they'll leave because they'll think I'll have a Nihilus. And even if they do fill left, it doesn't matter a ton for us because, uh. Wa Ooh, Wong's a little scary, but I mean, they should only have two mana, right? Yeah. Okay. Nice. How that a very negative hobgoblin sweet so we got our pick of the litter here perfect so we can get the Celine down uh well let's do a middle because i don't want to give them a negative one power Celine, it's kind of just taking a slot if we played in xander but we can play hood left and that'll have negative six power and that my friends is much nicer so we can play this here this is almost a build your own hobgoblin. We'll have Black Widow as well. Oh, nice. So we get to hit him with a Black Widow. Mm. Next turn. Uh, we'll play left, and then we'll probably play Werewolf. Okay, so we know... Ooh, never mind, we're playing Werewolf here. And then... Ooh, nice. Oh, ho, ho. Black Widow. Oh, no, no, no. I'm still on my uh, old wave where that just took a uh, draw from them. So we can do this and then this and then we can Viper the Selene over or just Sentry Havoc. What is this? Galactus? Whoa ho ho! Alright, so now we need our... Uh, uh, we need a Nihilus here? <sighs> nope. 
Well, we have priorities. They can't, uh... They can't ally with us. Annihilus is not enough. Nice. Take down Galactus. Okay. Uh, Hood's a good one here. We can throw that over if we need to. Nightcrawler. Ooh, so is this a... Uh, Nightcrawler is probably either Cerebro 2 or more likely a control list. By control, I mean like a prison lockout. Let's see, we're definitely hoping to draw our Annihilus here. Selene would still be really good though. Oh yeah. This is not Cerebro 2. Usually it's Thanos though, if they're playing a Koye. Ooh, so we can fill them up here. And then play Sentry. Mm, let's do this, and then we can play Sentry Middle. And snap. I'm going to snap, and then either turn 5 we'll play Annihilus, or we can drop this Havoc. One mana Havoc is so powerful. Nice. Alright, so now we're up left by 4, and each of us only have one spot. Let's play the Sentry here. Keep our left spot open. They might have an Odin. They're playing Ironheart and a Koye. I'm not sure what they're doing. But Shadow King is also four power left. <clears throat> Might be enough to uh, take that one down. Want. Okay, so they are some kind of uh, Odin list. I think I'm just going to play Havoc. I think I'm just going to play Havoc in one spot, but I don't know where. Mm, let's just go Havoc left. That's eight power left. I think it's pretty hard for them, and they this also denies them... Uh... No, no, no. Not with Nightcrawler there. <laughs> but this also denies them a... Uh... Ooh, nice. So now we can go Selene, Viper. Eh, it's actually better to just go uh, Shadow King here, Viper. And then... That's a lot of power. So we're tying right. If they move the Nightcrawler right and get enough power of mid, they might have a chance, but... This is... Decent amount of power. Oh yeah, because we reset the Okoye too. Ooh, hoo -hoo. Shadow King putting in work. That's for sure. Ooh. They probably draw our Nihilus. Nice. That's four more power left. Havoc. One power Havoc. Thanks for making it to the end of the video. If you liked what you saw, please hit that like button and feel free to subscribe. And stay tuned for more Marvel Snap goodness.